hello there and welcome to the massively overdue episode 4 of my Let's Play Minecraft Season 2. Now as you've probably seen I'm in a completely different area um, and the reason for that is the old area was somehow corrupted in some strange way. As some of you may have known if I walked in a particular direction more than a few blocks from where I started it crashed without fail. So I don't know whether there was some weird corruption thing in that direction that I was walking or I don't know. I mean I removed all the mods completely, stripped it clean, reloaded, same thing. So there was something wrong with the map. Um, so that was pretty much it and then just as I was starting to decide that I need to generate a new map then I get the eye infection and then I can't see very well and basically to cut a long story short I'm back I've got the new version as you can see 1.4 I've got a selection of mods nothing overpowered just general stuff and I've duplicated in this chest what I had in the nether, minus the nether stuff, because the mod that uh, that gave me all the weird um, nether related stuff, that's not dated even 1.3, let alone 1.4. So everything except that is in here. So as you can see, that's, uh, that's good. So, you know, I don't have to be punching trees straight away. Um, that's pretty much it, really. Um, you know, as per last episode, I've escaped the nether. Um, let's just pretend that I ended up just being dumped here um, and uh, yeah I'm gonna crack on because I haven't played I haven't played Let's Play for a while um, so anyway I'm gonna crack on and see about getting some of this stuff sorted the idea for this I'm gonna have to build a home um, I completely messed up where are all my arrows? did I use up all my arrows? I have no idea I just put some of this stew here and yeah that'll do an axe there and meh. That should do. Do I have any feathers? No. I have to keep an eye out for some chickens. I don't hear any chickens. Good idea for me to look for chickens, is that possible? Well there's a sheep. Anyway first port of call is to clear out a bit of a space here. Yes, I know I'm chopping trees, but at least I've got a bit of a head start with the tools. Now I always leave one block just there, so I can jump on it and then reach higher. Because sometimes they're quite tall and you can't quite get to that top bit of log. So there we go, that's sorted. I'm getting my saplings. All right. One thing I need to do is make a workbench. Blimey neck, I'm rusty. Honestly, I actually am having to think, hang on a second. So I'm doing that and, and that and and that and that makes that I'm ugh. No, I really did not want to leave it this long. But you know what it's like, you, you know, one thing after another, as they say. But no, I'm all cool now, so, doctor says I can wear my lenses and whatnot, so I can actually see, which is always nice. I think that's not a bad little spot. Now what I really want to do is just make a home for myself before night falls. The actual home is going to be out there in the deep blue, as some of you may have guessed. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> yeah. Right. Just chuck that in there, chuck that in there. I've got some wood, I've got some stone. Blah, blah, blah. Need a door. I may actually post how far I got with the other realm. It was really annoying. 
on the other map because I've got to build this nice little home and I've got everything sorted out and I've got me chests and me furnaces and you know when you get everything nice and organized and settled and you s you sit back and you think oh that's a nice home I like that and then I got all my stuff stored in my chest and then I wander off to try and you know explore a little bit and boom crashes reload hasn't saved the only thing it saved was what was in my inventory which was nothing and basically I ended up losing everything and I'm kind of like yeah, so. but what can you do you gotta take the rough with the smooth as they say is that an innuendo phrase I've just suddenly wondered hmm. I think I'm gonna make one more door Grab the rest of that. Um, yeah. It will probably be a good idea for me to actually make some torches. So if I put a furnace here, I suppose. Um, there we go. It's not the most efficient way of doing things, but it will do for now. Put one more crafting table, say... there. And a chest. The way I figure it, I'm probably going to be here for a while, so might as well make myself a bit of storage. And then... I just want a nice looking house. I know that I'm going to probably have to cut more wood to get enough to do this, but you know, when you get an idea of how you want something to look and... See? Double doors. Sweet. Four steps should be enough. Um, um bleh. So I've kind of got it in my head how I want this to look, but you know when it comes down to it you sort of stumble a little. That's not too bad. So if I have a sort of ladder ladder, what am I talking about? If I have the steps going up like that, that should be good enough. Look at that. Like a pro. Sort of. Okay, got me charcoal. No. A few torches. Oh, look at that. Just in time. It's getting dark. Just going to put it on either side. I suppose I should move that. Yeah. Well, I'm sure it'll be fine. One thing I do like about this is the fact that you can make these wooden slabs. I'm not sure how you can make a wooden slab, doesn't sound quite right to me, but it does mean you get a lot more options with things. Let's put that there. There we go. I don't think I could put another one there. No, that should be enough. Right. Well, that's that then. Look at that. And that is pretty beautiful. You see, I've got this wonderful mod um, that basically makes coral reefs. And some of the species of coral actually glow. And that is just beautiful. Oh, we've got a skeleton there. Come to investigate. Alright, I'm pretty happy with the way this is going. Something special. Doesn't hurt to have more furnaces either. 
Right, I am going to brave the outside and collect things from the chest out here. Oh, nearly five. Oh, I'm not going to quite have enough. Come on, two off. Stupid sheep. What the hell? What the? Yes, it's scary out here, but for goodness sakes, it's not allowed. It's out of my house, you stupid, stupid cows. Ugh. Honestly, you do wonder sometimes at animals. You just leave your door open for one second, and suddenly they're everywhere, just crowding you in. Um, bleh. that'll do. Oh my goodness! Come on, you! Come on! Come in! You're welcome. Oh. Ah! I destroyed my torch. <clears throat> oh yeah! Come on then. One way of getting some arrows. Whew. Well, that was energetic. Probably unnecessarily energetic. But, I think... You know what, I've just come up with an idea. Why put the furnaces there while they're so they take up space? When what I can do do that. Bit strange, but probably works quite well. Stupid sheep! You're gonna get yourself killed, man. I actually feel that I'm a bit rusty doing the whole let's play. I feel a bit sort of, I don't know, a bit weird. Right. I think that I'm, well I'm sorted out for now and next episode I can start exploring those coral reefs because they look absolutely wicked. They're looking good. So yeah, hopefully by next episode. It's a very small moon. You'll make me mad, boy. Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Um, don't hurt me, Mr. Skeleton. Oh my god. Oh. Eat. Eat the stew. I think there's no um, denying that it's on hard difficulty, and I am a noob. Whew. Okay, well, I think that is plenty for now. I think that I've... Uh, I could always make some vague form of protection. There we go. A nice leather cap. There you go. Oh, I'm like Indiana Jones. I'm sort of a an adventurer. I mean, why I'd wear a hat on top of a hood, I'm not sure. But that's what I'm doing, and, and that's, that's what I'm going to stick to. Just rearrange that a bit, you know. Yeah, yeah, shut up. I think they want my brains.
Right. Well, it's getting light, so uh, until next time, cheerio.